What's up, what's up, y'all? It's your boy, Dre, a.k.a. Huge American. Shout out to all my West Indians. You got Labor Day coming up to my NYC people. Holla at me. So, your boy out here sweating buckets. It's about 90-something degrees, but you got to do what you got to do. So, I want to go House of Innovation, Nike Town. Had a sneaker pass. So, I'm just, boom. Ah, so, we got a sneaker pass. So, cool. Nike, NYC. You already know. So, based on this box, something special. Because no regular Nikes come to this box. So, before we even continue, hold it down for one quick second. Alright, continuing. Let's look at the front of the box. Let's see what it says. Nike Blazer Low Sakai. Size 12, you already know my size. And I feel like this is the best color to come out for all Blazers Sakai's. Not just because I actually got this one. As much as I'm a fan of green, these. I didn't get the Travis Scott's. But these brown ones look better than the iron gray. These brown ones look better than the, what is it, the orange? And I'm not a fan of low tops, but these is cool. These are definitely cool. So, I'm gonna check this out real quick. What's up, the angle man look a little hot. So, ah, I like the double Nike checks. I dig it, I dig it. It's a lot of white. Uh, like I said, I'm not really a fan. I like trying to buy and collect things that's you know unique these are different um it's that stitching oh well you already know stitching issues so you got two tongues which is a little weird in my opinion they should just honestly should have left it a red tongue that would have been cool just leave it as nike sakai said nike sportswear ao disclaimer that's one of my hashtags nike sportswear um you got the back heel. See, these are like wallabies in my opinion. Like, blazer wallabies. That's some thick, excuse my language, I'm beat myself. Thick, beep, pattern. Yo, look at this. Yeah, that's sweat, I'm sorry. Look at this. So you got the Nike Sakai on the insole. But let me have a seat. <laughs> You know how much foam this is right here? Look, I don't have a fat finger, but the foam is actually about, you could say as wide or slightly a little bit wider than my finger is nearly as wide as my thumb. That's crazy of foam, why? So I don't know if these are gonna look doofy on my feet or not. If you want, leave me a like, smash that like button. And drop me a comment. If you want me to try these on, see how these look on feet with some jeans, I can do it for you guys. But to me, like I said, if it should have had one tongue, red tongue, cool. The two tongues, a mm, little different in my opinion. But I wear my jeans behind the tongue. And I'm ready to look at it now. I'm a tall guy, 6'1". This might look a little bit long. Just how the sheep is, there's not too much of an angle or slope. It's just like, <sighs> this is definitely a cute shape, but I love the colorway. The uh, khaki brown and red is cool, but it's a no for me. I don't know how long I'm gonna keep these, but these are definitely a no. I thought it was cool. Honestly, you know, like the fact that it's different and not a lot of people have these. It's rare, it's limited. But it'll be a no dog. Definitely a no for me. Typical blazer. So so I'm gonna tell you what blazer I do have. So I'm always finding all types of faults or whatever not. Anyway, I'm gonna tell you a blazer I do have. I have the Nike Blazer Sketch, which is similar to like the Air Max One Sketch the Shelf, Tinker Half Hatfields, but I got the Nike Blazer Sketch and I got the black pair and then the red pair I believe was Europe exclusive i don't think those released in the u.s they say they're like 200 dollars each now which is cool i might wear those i tried those on the material is cheap but they look better than these i like the colorway but if these were high top these would be way better again if these are high top with one tongue these would be a lot better to me i like that nike tongue nike sakai but I'm honestly just not really a fan of the lows. They look too low, if you get what I'm saying. Just because, look at it, it's barely any height. 
These look like these show my ankles. If it wasn't that much like exposed foam. Well, I can say these must be hella comfortable. So if you actually own a pair of Sakai Blazers, how do you feel? I will, like I said, if you want, leave me a comment, drop me a like, um, and let me know if you would like to see a video of me trying these on. Uh, if not, it's cool. Just show me some love and ask for what kind of stickers you want to see. My Shadow Backboards, my Travis Scott, another view. Uh, Royals versus uh, Shatters, let me know. Or Royals versus... Uh, the, the Travis Scott fragments talk to me show me some love let me know what kind of footage you want to see so far no concert coming up which out Justin Bieber but his, can his concert canceled at Madison Square Garden postponed to next year so still got two floor, floor seat tickets gotta figure out if I'm gonna do this for my page or just sell them tickets anywho thanks for checking out my video I'm guessing it says like Sakai or whatever yeah, S A E yeah, and Nike, Nike Sakai on the tissue paper. But again, do you like these? Are these the best colorway to release for the lows or in general for all blazer uh, mid highs or mids and lows? So let me know your thoughts. The colorway is cool, just not a fan of low. It looks too low, looks too long, but they look really comfortable. That's all I can say. Double tongue, again, not a fan. Extra high heel, not really a fan, but that just sounds like me being picky. Anyway, it's your boy. Shout out for checking out my video. I am hot. Need to go home, eat ice cream, drink some water, and probably have fun and smoke some hookahs tonight. You already know. Your boy still celebrating a birthday. Team Leo's. One love, y'all. Over and out.